Hey, hey, Taya Bays, welcome back to my channel. It is Taya and I am back with another wig review. And in today's video, I am going to be telling you a little bit about the wig that I'm wearing right now. This is Bobby Boss Tion in the color TT4430. So if you want to know a little bit more about Miss Tion, then keep on watching. This is Bobby Boss's Tion wig in the color TT4430. This is one of their wigs in their Wonder Sleek series. So it is made from optimized silky yakky fiber. It is supposed to be tangle free and have a smooth texture. And it has a five inch lace part, hand knotted lace part. It's supposed to be able to be hot water and hot roller curls so it should be able to withstand some level of heat it does come with baby hairs um i did notice that the baby hairs actually looked very um, nice i didn't choose to use any of the baby hairs today as you can see but what i noticed about this wig versus some of the other wigs i've been seeing with baby hairs lately is that the baby hairs are just actually very kind of wispy and natural uh, but again i chose not to wear them isn't this color pretty? I actually have had this wig just sitting in my closet for a really long time and finally got a chance to take her out of the package and throw her on. And as I'm wearing it, I am remembering this color. The reason why I got this wig was that I saw somebody's review a while ago in this color and I thought it was absolutely gorgeous. I can't remember who, but if I remember who, I'll put it up here somewhere on the screen. But um, I gotta say, I still love the color. I think this color is so pretty. And I really, really love how the dark roots flow into the rest of the color of the wig. Super duper pretty. She is in a middle part and there's not really any ear, ear tab action um, that would make it not able to be shifted to the left or right. So actually, let me see really quick. Okay, okay. Anyway, so yeah, as you can see, she can be shifted pretty easily, pretty nicely to either side. There's not really any kind of obstructive 
um, ear tabs that will keep you from doing that. And she's just another long, straight wig. It's not too much to say about this wig, but I definitely do have some cons of this wig that I am going to share with you um, right now, actually. So I want to go ahead and get the cons of this wig out of the way because, to be quite honest with you, there's a few of them. <laughs> so let's start with the cons and then we can finish off on a positive note with a couple of the things that I like about this particular wig. Uh, first con of this wig is honestly, uh, and it's kind of probably kind of silly because it literally says on the package that it's silky, but y'all, she is silky. Like to me, this looks a lot like baby doll hair or like Barbie hair, and I just can't really get with that. Like, it's not really working for me like it's just so silky that to me it just looks incredibly unrealistic and i just can't i can't get past that you know like i just i don't like that um at all and then paired with the length altogether, to me the wig just gives off a really um unnatural look look how long this wig is you guys like it comes down past like my hip bone like it's down there um if it was to be to the back it's definitely down to my butt it's so long and that wouldn't be a terrible thing but because it is so silky along with being this long to me it just really looks like it's screaming i'm fake okay it is hollering i'm wicked like <laughs> The next thing that I don't really like about this wig is that I feel like one of the claims of this Wonder Sleek series that even was stated on this stock card is that it's supposed to be tangle free and that is 100% without a doubt a lie. Like that's a whole fib. Like it's not true. This thing is tangling and it's not, it's not surprising as long as it is and with this texture that it's so tangly but it's just like kind of funny that they have the audacity. <laughs> to put Tangle Free on the package and all I've gotten since I got this out of the package before I even put it on my head was tangled. Like it was just clearly tangling on itself already before I even put it on myself. That was a bit of a, um, it was an untruth. <laughs> I know you can't really see it or maybe you can, I really don't know, but there is so much hair so much of this hair in this brush it's crazy it's doing a whole lot of shedding you guys so a lot of the hair is just coming right on out into my brush so please be mindful of that as well this one is going to uh, definitely shed on you and i think i think that that was all of my cons so let me just go ahead and hop right into um my pros of this wig first of all absolutely love the color i love the color it's shiny um because of the texture but the color itself is really really pretty to me and the color itself looks pretty nice and natural too. Another thing that I like about this wig is the part. I think that the part looks really nice. It's a five inch um, lace part and I didn't pluck it or anything. I just went ahead and put some powder in the part and I think it looks really good, really natural. And it was just super duper easy. Just threw some powder in there and it's good to go. It's laying really flat. It's laying really flat. I think that's because it's so tight. So I have to mention to you that this wig is in no way big head friendly. Or you know, maybe if I was to loosen up, I don't know. No, I won't even say that. I was gonna say if I loosen up my um, elastic, elastic band, what am I thinking of? Draw, draw strings? Adjustable straps, <laughs> Lord. What I was gonna say is if I loosened up the adjustable straps, it might be big head friendly, but that's a lie because right now I don't even have all the tightest hooks like I usually wear my wigs. And it's really just the cap. The cap is is pretty small. Um, yeah, I wonder if you can tell. The cap is pretty small and I realized that when I was putting it on my head and had to kind of yank it forward. This, this wig is not big head friendly, so please be mindful of that. If you have a larger head, 
probably not the one for you, sis, honestly and truly. Hey, let me know if you have tried Tian, because she's been out for a while. Um, I know I purchased her a while ago and just got around to filming this video. So let me know down in the comments section below if you have tried Tian and if and how you felt about her, like right out of the package. Like I'm I'm, I'm actually pretty disappointed in this one. I thought she was gonna be a winner, but to be honest with you, I don't really see myself wearing her too much. I think if I do wear her out, I would definitely, yeah, I think that's gonna work for me. I'm gonna cut her. Yep, I think I'm gonna have to go ahead and cut Tian, and I think that might make her at least slightly more wearable to me because to me right now she is not a wearable wig for me okay guys that's about it for this video i don't really have anything else to say about bobby boss tion but of course if you have any questions you can leave those down in the comment section below and i'll be sure to get back to you i'm gonna go ahead and wrap this one up so i will catch you guys in the next video if you are not already subscribed to my channel please make sure that you hit that subscribe button and that like button before you take off and i will catch you guys in the next one bye